The National Renewable Energy Lab researches and develops renewable energy technologies right here in our very own backyard in Arvada. Just behind me, scientists, they're working on things like charging systems for those heavy duty commercial trucks, even power sources for ships. The president's visit is going to put a focus on this kind of work and of course the people who do it as well. A key part of the president's Build Back Better plan is those green jobs and workforce training. We went ahead and checked and Colorado is doing pretty good here. A recent report showed we're 18th in the country with almost 60,000 people working in clean energy jobs. That sounds slightly from years past because it, like all other industries, really did take a hit during the pandemic. We have all seen those we're hiring signs at restaurants, coffee shops, hotels, really you name it. Chef Frank's Bonanno Concept Restaurants are an example of this. Six months ago, they were trying to keep some of their restaurants open and staffed. They were able to do that by offering incentives. We're talking about things like pay raises for cooks and dishwashers. Even bringing on board a mental health professional staff has access to. We had to take our group from uh, where we were then and add about 150 employees, um, which which we did in the span of two months, and it was it was hard um, <laughs> for sure. We also realized, you know, a month or two into that hiring process, that we were not going to make it doing this doing it the same way we had always done. And back here at the National Renewable Energy Lab, another topic that the president's going to touch on is modernizing our structure. This lab is really on the forefront of that science, researching more efficient buildings and strengthening our power grid. In Arvada, I'm Veronica Acosta, Denver 7.